This South Carolina offensive line class in 2023 is on paper probably the best in the modern recruiting era for the program. Uh, multiple four stars, multiple Under Armour and Army all or I guess Adidas All Americans, uh, guys that were highly recruited. Uh, and one of the biggest victories was Marky Anderson uh, out of Dorman High School, an in-state prospect from the state of South Carolina. Uh, Dorman High School has not been kind to the Gamecocks over the years. It's, it's a large, powerful program in the upstate, in, in my hometown of Spartanburg, actually. Very familiar with Dorman. Uh, and most of their players go to Clemson or are out of state. Uh, J.J.R. Sega Whiteside uh, from Stanford, who got drafted a wide receiver. He was from Dorman. Uh, Sharon Peak, uh, multiple players. Uh, Jordan McFadden, who goes to Clemson right now, one of their starting offensive linemen. Uh, they've just kind of had a pipeline in there, but the Gamecocks snapped a long losing streak on the field against the Tigers this year and also snapped a losing streak at Dorman. They dated back about 15 years by landing Marquis Anderson. Big, powerful, versatile guy. Uh, probably projects on the inside. Can't rule out right tackle in a pinch. Um, you know, just a, a big time athlete uh, that played at one of the highest levels of football in the state of South Carolina, high school wise, and certainly from a school where South Carolina wants to do better uh, recruiting uh, wise. He committed over the summer, uh, picked the Gamecocks over North Carolina, uh, and has been solid ever since. A, a very big pickup uh, for the Gamecocks and uh, certainly is one that you may want to point to here in a couple of years if the Gamecocks can continue. Uh, at least holding their own at Dorman High School and, and signing their share of talent uh, from that very, very good program in the upstate.